So when someone comes in with vision loss, they often are very nervous and very worried about what the future is going to be like without vision. And so to help someone through that and to be able to bring some vision back, it's sort of one of the reasons that we do this. And it's the reason that I'm here and doing the best I can for patients. In general, I see any disease process that affects the retina. Those include macular degeneration and diabetes. I also treat retinal detachments, which is more of a surgical intervention. Retinal surgery is one of the most delicate subspecialties of ophthalmology. The surgeries that we do involve tissue that's directly in communication with the brain. A lot of tissues that we work with are a fraction of a millimeter. The retina itself is only about half a millimeter thick because if the retina is damaged, just like if the film is in your camera is damaged, uh, you won't see as clear of an image. Just like with a camera, you couldn't take as clear a picture. But choosing to work at the New York Eye and Ear Infirmary in Mount Sinai was a really easy decision for me. It's one of the oldest programs in the country. It has always had an impeccable reputation and high standards for both clinical care and research in, in the field of ophthalmology. And I really couldn't think of a place I'd rather be.